Church family, are you excited to be here on Palm Sunday? I am. I'm excited. Looks like many of you are excited. We got a lot of guests here today, and we're so excited to have an opportunity to baptize um, a family today. And uh, it's one of our school families that's come to our ministry uh, through Fayette Christian School. It's the Scott family. And uh, I'm just going to go ahead and ask right now because we're going to baptize three in this family. If you're here, um, friends, family for these baptisms, would you stand right now in honor of their baptism today? Thank you so much for being here. It's awesome. Got a whole crew right here. Thank you all so much for coming to be a part of this. You guys can have a seat. So this is Annalyn Scott. Annalyn's six years old. And uh, about a month ago, um, I got contacted by Adam, and we began to talk and uh, about his relationship with the Lord and about his kids' relationship with Christ. And uh, God had been stirring really with our whole family. And so um, we met in, our, in my office about a month ago. We talked with the girls um, about salvation. They were having a desire to be saved, to have a relationship with Jesus Christ. And we walked through um, what Scripture says, and we kind of left it with them, and they took some stuff home. And they went home. And over the next few weeks, they just dived into the Word. They actually watched some videos. And um, God really began to deal with their hearts. And at home, um, Annalyn prayed and received Christ, asked Jesus to save her, and she's here on Believer's Baptism. So, Annalyn, upon your profession of faith and obedience to the command of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, I baptize you, my sister, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, buried with Christ by baptism, raised to walk in newness of life. Church family, this is Lily Bell, and she is seven years old, and she got in the baptistry, she said, ooh, it's hot, and uh, I'm grateful to hear that. Normally I hear, ooh, it's cold, so that's a good thing. Um, but just like her sister, um, she, uh, she's been learning about Jesus at school and at church. And God's been doing a work in her heart. And uh, it's neat talking to them about the desire that God's put in their life uh, to want to know him at a young age. And again, she was able to go home too and process this at home. And uh, with her parents at home, she prayed and asked Christ to save him, to change her. And uh, she's here on Believer's Baptism. So, Lily Bell, upon your profession of faith and obedience to the command of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, I baptize you, my sister, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Mary Christ, by baptism, raised to walk in newness of life. Church family, this is Adam Scott, and Adam is a big dude, okay? We were talking about Adam earlier, and uh, he's a man's man, and uh, I, I want to just brag on him for a second. Um, he called me um, right before his kids, and we talked, and uh, he was uh, he was just just wanted to share what God's done in his life. And um, over the past year, God's been working on him. And uh, back in February, on the way home from work uh, in his car, he just came to a place of, God, I, I want you to be my Lord and Savior. Um, I'm repenting of my sins. I want to follow you wholeheartedly. And he he called, and he was broken. He shared that with me, what God's been stirring his heart for. But not only his salvation, but just wanting to be a godly dad, wanting to be a godly father, wanting to be a godly husband. And listen, we need more godly fathers, more godly husbands. I just appreciate him. And I want to encourage everybody to pray for Adam as he leads his home, as he leads his family. It's not, it's not easy. It's a challenge. Um, but I know God has equipped him to do that. He's going to continue to equip him. And so, Adam, upon your profession of faith and obedience to the command of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, I baptize you, my brother, in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Buried Christ by baptism, raised to walk in the newness of life. 